Right, hi folks. Obviously, you know my ugly mug. As usual, channel name, wherever the channel name you know, or should know who I am by now. If not, don't pay any sense. Uh, as you know, as people know, obviously last year I stopped, no, end of 2015 I stopped modelling, no, middle of 2015, uh, excuse me, I stopped, well not stopped modelling, took a hiatus for obvious reasons which I explained in my pre the previous video to this, last, which was last year. I am still not able to model for various reasons going on with, with the, uh, in the house, which is not personal things, it's just so, um, sorting out the <laughs> sorting out the um, logistics of where I'm going to build and that. I do want to build, I see a lot of people that I'm subscribed to is build, builds on Facebook and I think I really should get back to building but I've got nowhere to build at the moment so I'm not building. Yes, before someone says it, that is a towel and I don't care. And that is my hoodie and I don't care. Now we've got the obvious things that people, my modelling friends will probably point out to me, over and done with. Yeah, obviously as I said, I can't build at the moment. It's not for want of doing... Because, obviously, as I said in my last video, I want to get that RC boat finished. I want to get my backlog of videos finished. Uh, backlog of videos? Backlog of part-built models finished. But, unfortunately, as of... Well, today is the 1st of... Sorry, 1st of March, so tomorrow would be, would, would have been my grandpa's 86th birthday. And about a month after that, it's the first anniversary of his passing, but I know it's going to get easier, well, easier to cope with, bear, whatever. But I do want to get back to modelling, as, as I said in my last video, he got me into it along with my parents and I want to get it done but I don't want to rush back into it I don't want to kind of, <coughs> excuse me, go well I'm ready but I've got nowhere to build so I'm not going to rush sort of thing which is what I'm doing now and I don't really want to go rushing into it headlong do a string of builds that I end up having to throw in a bin because of that mucked them up that badly. <coughs> uh, as I said, I've been watching a lot of few videos and that, and I know there was one video recently where someone was saying about <coughs> um, about the community and the fact that it seems to be splintered again, or splint splintering, or trying to splinter, or whatever. Unfortunately, it seems, when I got back into the hobby, 2010-11, so in the last six, to six, six, seven years, I have seen people fall out with one another, and that it just seems like most things to go in cycles. But at the end of the day, it, it's one of those things, yes, it's not nice to see people that were friends, no longer friends and that, and people trolling one another and that. But unfortunately, it happens. And you just got to deal with it as and when it happens. Unfortunately, I've been lucky enough not to have fallen a cropper of that. But as I said, it just happens in cycles. It comes in waves and that. Recently, uh, but, oh, but recently as well, I've been I've been busy um, busy 
with, as I've mentioned in passing before in previous videos over the last few years, I'm in a band with my, well, I haven't said who I'm in it with, I'm in a band with one of my, well, one of my brothers and our friend, and possibly another friend of ours drumming, but that's um, a subject for, well, I know it's not people going, oh, it's not talking about modelling, but it's part of the reason, obviously, that I've not felt a strong need to come back to, well, no. I feel a strong need to come back, but I have other creative outlets as well. And I know Frankie Day plays his guitar on his channel. I'm not... And that that's his channel. At the end of the day, we can do whatever we want with our channels. But I won't be putting my band's music up on this channel. So obviously this channel is for scale modelling. And as some of my friends <coughs> know, some, some of you guys that watch these videos and that know, because obviously you've got friends with me on Facebook and that, end of last year, I managed to, um, well, managed to, I got a girlfriend, not managed to get a girlfriend. And no, I won't <laughs> Uh, before someone says, oh, will you not be modeling, uh, stepping away from modeling for me even longer? No, she knows that I'd be able to scale model. She understands and accepts it. Mainly because it's me. It's me and she accepts me for me. Um, what else? That's basically all personally that I really want to... to um, get back to modelling, hope to do soon, but only time will tell, because as I said um, in my video last year, because it was summer, I volunteer at the local pool in the village ne ne near to mine, I live in a village called Great Hell, the village next door to mine is called Hessington, and that's where I volunteer at the pool at, and that takes up a fair chunk of my summer. So at this rate, it, depending on what happens, I may not be modelling till the end of this year, beginning of the next. I hope not, because, excuse me, I know darn well I'm going to have to have a easy build or whatever to ease myself back into the building of scale models and that. But... I definitely, I do want to come back, and I, I, I will say thanks to Andy Wapping that a while. I think about it for his kind words on my video, where I opened up a lot about what had gone on. Um, sorry about that smirky laugh there. One of my friends just messaged me on Facebook. On my, uh, obviously, as I'm said, I'm on my tablet saying something. Um, yeah, uh, so thanks to Andy for his support and that and thanks for everyone else who's had their support and understanding in the community and as I said the community it's one of those things community is like a family scale one of the community is like a family we there will be times we fight like cat and dog and fall out with one another and not get on with people and that it happens in cycles as I said basically family and I'm not going to sit here and cast judgment on people for not getting on with people because in my past I've got had people that I didn't got on with and then didn't get on with and people had people tell me I should get on with them or give them chance upon chance. But I know personally, from personal experience, you cannot get on with everyone. But yeah, uh, it's nearly 10 minutes for this video. I've rambled and that my way through the video hopefully I'll be back doing this by summer mainly because for Christmas as some as you saw some some of you saw if you're on the groups I post to I got well middle of last year I got the FX 124 scale mosquito in with the what's the name to build it in my grandpa's honor there's a lot of things I'm building so I'm finishing off the boat 
it to honour him and obviously the Mosquito. Yeah. Obviously the Mosquito. Um, um, for Christmas I got a spray booth and a hard Hardesty Beck Ultra 2, the 2 in 1. Steve Beck, Steve Beck, I don't care how it's pronounced. Um, uh, obviously, I've got I've got a compressor the year before for Christmas, and so I've really got to get on and use them. And I want to come back. I know people are a lot of people will be waiting for me and welcome me back with open arms, so to speak. Um. But yeah, I'm sorry this video has been rambling all over the place, but as any of you who've seen my videos in the past will know, my videos tend to be all over the place because I don't script them. I don't see the point of scripting them because if I'm working from a script, I will feel very wooden and very unnatural. I'd rather just let what I've got to say flow than go, well, this is what I'm going to do. Blah blah blah. I've looked, just looked generally stiff and wooden with my um, video and that. But as I said, I, I, I should be back by, I'm hoping to be back by summer because there's lots of st stuff, but it all depends with what goes on, this, that, and the other. So if I can, I can. If I can't, I can't. But I will be back, and I know. I, was, I, was, I know people will be right here to welcome you right now when I get back. And as I said, one final thank you to Andy for his support and anyone, everyone who supported me while I've been um, taking this hiatus. This hiatus, as I said, started end of 20, mid to end of 2015. And my intention wasn't to be on hiatus for as long as I have. But things take time, obstacles get in the way, and as other people have said, real life before scale models. Anyway, thank you for sitting here and listening to me ramble for nearly 13 minutes. I have been Darkblade88. Hopefully I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. Keep modelling. Enjoying what you do.